Hello, this is Rolf Tomazon. I am back with part 34 of my collection. It's been a while since I made a last collection video, but um, I was waiting on a bunch of things to come in the mail. Today, the last of which arrived, thus I am here making the video. Um, I'll start off with this one, my uh, brand new Hana Hanami. Um, I'm sure you guys must have seen the review I made. Um, if you haven't, just go to my channel. It's the last video up top. Um, if you watch the review you'll know all about it. Um, so this is one. Oh, and um, uh, it was starting to bother me that I was gonna uh, accidentally rub off the writing. So I don't know if you can see it on the camera but um, I put in like screen protectors on the writings so that I wouldn't accidentally rub them off and then you know putting my fingers on it won't make any difference anymore. So just my OCD about <laughs> my collection. So um, there's that and I have to apologize about not making the second part that I had promised because before my Hana Hanami made it to nine years of age in which it could breed it died so um, hopefully in the next few weeks I'm gonna have some free time in which I plan to run it again and then make it to nine years of age without it dying this time and then so I can show you all the mating process which is very interesting so yeah there's that um, after that is my Princess Spacey IDL um, I've also made a review on this on my channel. If you haven't seen it, please go ahead and check it out. Um, so this is the box of it, and it is this guy. I bought this um, cover from a member on Tamazon. I think it was Mellocup, if I'm not mistaken. Um, the reason I got this is because it is dreadfully pink. So this black cover is able to hide some of the hideousness so um, it's also a really good quality it reminds me of the quality of like hacky sacks from back in high school and stuff so um, there is this so also um, I'm not sure if she's still making covers or not but feel free to contact her on Tamazon I'm sure she'd be happy to uh, give you a yes or no on that so yeah there's that after that, I won this auction on the very last plush I was missing in my collection, which was the Kuchi Tamachi one. Um, thankfully, no one else bid, so I won the auction for like six or seven bucks. I can't remember exactly how much, but it was very low. So yeah, this completes my plush collection, which was a happy note. There's that. After that, I got this uh, limited edition uh, Entama, it is the C-I-A-O, I think it's pronounced as Chao, I'm not sure, um, edition, um, a Kuchipachi one, which is this one, plus uh, Mamechi and the Memechi designs were also released. Um, I had been after the Kuchipachi one, but I just couldn't find one on eBay until a member on Tamazon uh, put hers up for sale. I think it was Sawibi, if I'm pronouncing that right. Um, so yeah, a big thank you to her for having put this up. And oh yeah, and she also included this um, bonus gift. <laughs> it's a big cover, but yeah, I'll just keep it in my collection. So yeah, that was really cool. There's this. After that, I got this Snow White uh, Entama. Um, I was looking for this particular design in the Entama shell because I see the version 4 duplicate a lot on eBay but I just didn't want the version 4 one. So I waited and finally found an Entama one for a decent price and I got it. And the, the seller included some candy in there for some reason but yeah. So yeah there was that which I was very happy about. And lastly I got this uh, limited edition K-Tai. Um, it is kind of like, ex actually exactly like the Plus one that was released back in 2004. Um, like the Plus, which had the vintage background plus the black 
uh, infrared bar up top. Uh, this too has the vintage background with the black infrared up top. Um, I didn't even know that uh, the Ketama version for this existed until quite recently. And when I was looking around, uh, a member on Tamazone by the name of Tama Kisser contacted me and said she had one up for sale and asked if I was interested. I jumped at the chance, so a huge thank you to her for having offered it to me. I'm very happy to add it to my collection. And so yeah, um, this has been it for this part. As always, I have a bunch of other stuff on the way coming. Um, once they arrive, I will make another part, but until then, au revoir.